Greetings and salutations to all you folks out there. We're tackling a 2v2v2 on the dark heart today, and I've got Orbital Potato on my team. Hey, man. Oh, it's good to be back in some Supreme Commander. We had a little bit of a break, but we're back, and I'd like to think that we're better than ever, but... I'm not entirely sure if that's correct. <laughs> that last game might be an indicator to the contrary, which, by the way, that, yeah. uh, that game is on Orbital Potatoes channel, so when you get done with this video, absolutely click that link in the description and check out the other game that we had over there. Oh, cheers, man. I, I, I appreciate that. that, that that's, uh, that's very nice of you. I oh, forgot oh. to change to UEF, so it looks like I'm playing Aeon. Woo! Are you? Well, that's okay. I, I absolutely butchered my start anyway. But since you're recording this one, nobody's going to see my start, which is great. Well, Don't see, look, you missed out on a start. prime opportunity to just not tell anyone. Would I, would I, me? Not tell anyone? No, I'm far too loud to, to do that. <laughs> oh, goodness. I think I'm playing as Seraphim, right? And I I don't really do anybody apart from UEF. Uh -huh. I, 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 and it's just, like, really weird to see such a weird like ACU and weird factories and weird mass extractors it's really really they're, weird they're the asymmetrical faction they're the alien weirdness in FA so alien it is weirdness. understandable um, you should totally overbuild power uh -huh. because you have glorious chunks of reclaim you have a Salem over there which is a thousand mass or so and then you have that one right there, which is about the same. Actually, you know what? We can hit the uh, 1,823 mass is the number on that Salem. Oh, geez, Louise. So it is. That is that is impressive, to say the least. So a nice little boost there. That is a couple of free T2 mass extractors, basically. Oh, yeah. I can deal with that. Okay. Here we go. And you can go over here and build a mass extractor over there okay i'm also going to be dispatching dudes down to the bottom to make sure that uh, everybody's cool with that we, we get some stuff going on down at the bottom and fingers crossed can i can my um engineer yeah they're hover okay that's cool yeah see see I, all I don't engineers play are amphibious <laughs> yeah I, I just i just i just don't play seraphim like at all like i know i know the uef ones were but i don't know like I don't know. They theoretically could be. I mean, there's 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 large factional differences, I suppose. I, I should really know that, shouldn't I? That's really embarrassing. Oh well, no matter. It's okay. Okay, we'll all free of you. Oh, thank you, man. I appreciate that. How's how's your start been? I think it is going all right. Uh huh. Um, I've got a land factory going down on this side with two engineers, so hopefully I'll get that built up before he gets any units over this way. I'm actually going to go for a couple of labs right off the bat to get over there in a speedy manner and maybe deny that engineer early. Uh -huh. um, uh -huh. Other than that, just pretty much normal stuff. I'm massively overbuilding power so that yeah. uh, when I start reclaiming, things will be awesome. This is very good news. This is very, very good news. Everything oh, you're, you're, is you're awesome. You're, 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 oh, man, you're still my mass extractor. What the hell do you think you're doing? What? Disgusting. What Disgusting. Now? What? Right, right down here. Oh right crap! There. I'm sorry, man. I you, did not even you, realize. You, you have it. That's just have disgusting. It. Suck up all the mass in the oh. area. Is that what it, we're I was, supposed to do? I was, I was gonna reclaim it, and then I was gonna like be, oh, ho, stole your mass, buddy. But <laughs> didn't really work. <laughs> That's didn't okay. I, I'll break. give it back. No, I, no, no, no. I, I don't want. Wait, no, I was trying to steal your mask, and then you're like, okay, I'm going to let you steal it. I'm going to gonna give it back to you. I'm going to gift it back to you after... Okay, I don't, I don't even want to pursue this route of conversation. It's far too weird. Okay. Okay. I'm about to overflow mass, so I definitely want to... Oh, you're overflowing mass. Stop it! Yeah. You're not I, supposed I'm to overflow. I'm upgrading all of my stuff, and I'm still overflowing 36 mass. And I'm building stuff. So, pause the engineer. Paul's what engineer? Which engineer? The engineer that's reclaiming. Just stop reclaiming for a minute. So you catch up. Oh, oh crap, yeah. Oh crap, I completely forgot that I was actually reclaiming that. I set him on a route that I didn't think would include the... Uh... Oh, it's only 74 mass anyway. I didn't think it would include that uh, that husk of the ship, but apparently I was uh, I was sorely mistaken. We decided to go there first rather than... Rather than go around all the trees yeah, that, I, that I gave him. What a you got a tank idiot. 
What a darn idiot. Okay, let's get some point defense set up here. Okay. And, yeah. Okay, great. We're gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine. You know what they say, man. Teamwork makes the dreams work. You ever heard that before? I have. You, you have told me this before. Of course. Of course I have. Oh, okay. goodness me. And I need to stop reclaiming because oh. I am about to overflow mass again. And then oh, we can start doing that. Let's go ahead and walk my ACU over here and we will build up some more power because we are still power stalling, son of a biscuit. All right. You have found yourself in ACU. Yeah, I have. What do you know about that? You know what? I don't really know what I'm going to do with it. I don't really know how I'm going to handle it, I'm afraid. I guess we're just going to fire away at each other for a while. <laughs> <laughs> as long as you don't shed too much health. I plan, I plan not on, on doing that. What's he doing? What's he doing? Is he... Is, I don't understand what he's doing. He seems to have gone... Uh, he seems to have invested fairly heavily in, in this site. Well, if you, you've you got Medusas on you, so you're actually in danger of dying. You need to get out right now. Yeah. You've got all that artillery fire hitter, hitting your commander. Yeah. He's going to push you right off the island. Oh, this is annoying. This is really annoying. Okay, I'll, I'll get this mass, and then I'll, I'll be like, uh, I'll be really salty about it. I'll reclaim all this mass, and then I'll get out of here. Okay, there we go. Oh, goodness me, I might die. No. I, I, I told you. <laughs> no, don't do this to me. All oh, these jesters. These jesters, they're going to be the death of me. Okay, I'm going to joust him. I'm going to joust him, man. Oh, no, dude. No, yeah, you can't seriously. die on me that soon. Why are you not running to the water? No. There we why, go. There why, we go. Why? I, why you do this to me? I managed. I managed to gift you all of my. Uh, it's all, all gonna of my explode though. Mass extractors. Is it gonna explode? I gifted yep. it to you. It is all oh, going to explode. Damn it. That's oh, okay. I'm gonna get it very, very quickly here. They saw around my tomfoolery. That's that's darned annoying, actually. All right, I'm gonna have to do something serious here. Oh, darn it. In fairness, though, that guy. Try hard has... mode engaged. Try hard mode engaged. He's also at the top of the leaderboard. He's got 3k more score than even you. That that does not bode well. That's okay, that we'll remedy it. Well. Please, please do. I, I wanna make sure that we are victorious. Uh, also, there's still like a bunch of mass over there, um, on the beaches. I think there should be. Oh, snap, crackle, pop! I forgot about that crap. All right, we're going to start anti-air. Why did I not think of this? Of course, the jesters are going to come after me, because yeah. of course they are. Well, you know, I can't really. I can't. Well, obviously, I can't see the rest of the map and what's going on, but I would imagine being the fact that we are famous international and popular YouTubers, you know, that we are the prime target. <laughs> I think that was the most overstated <laughs> assumption that I've ever heard. Well, prime target. No, it's just me. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah, no. Um, yeah, you know what? That's that's going to be my excuse. That's going to be my excuse. Also, also at this time of recording, I want to make I want to make it absolutely clear that it's 2 a.m. for me, um, so I have I have a valid excuse. I have a valid excuse. I feel. All right, this is stupid. The amount of power stall that I'm undergoing at the moment. So I have a swift wind. I'm gonna use it to kill these jesters, and I'm not building any more air until I get some power online because otherwise I am going to doom myself. I'm sure everyone watching this cast at the moment is absolutely cringing at the amount of power <laughs> stall that's going on. Oh, all those engineers. Oh, look at those engineers. Look at those naval factories. Oh, We're man. Kill ourselves a T2 oh, naval HQ. factory. Oh, the HQ. Oh, man. Oh, man. That is beautiful. That is beautiful. Are you going to get the kill? You reckon you're going to get the kill? Uh, I think I'm actually going to go for the base. Look at that. Two T2 engineers. 
Oh. Woohoo! We're gonna get some P-Gens. We're gonna get oh. a mass extractor. Oh, this is juicy. This is very, very juicy indeed. Oh, just, oh, just rampage. Go on a rampage, mate. Go on a rampage. Do it. Oh, this is beautiful. This is beautiful. Oh, he's got a point defense up. No, get away. Don't kill all of my beautiful tanks. All right, so I gotta get some more stuff out here. Um, let's see, I can go ahead and reclaim all these mass extractors. Let's go ahead oh, and finish off this land factory and get another one up. All You're right, we're about to have a T2P gen up, so we will be good to go after that. All right, actually did some good here. Uh, can I can I make? Um... No, no, that's that's fine. That's fine. I mean. I don't know what this guy's doing, like, I, the guy to the right of you. I don't know what he's doing. I don't know, I don't know what well, he's doing. Well, I'm gonna have to get an air scout over there. Yeah. Because, um, obviously now I finally have power so I can start building some air. Yeah. Oh, nice, man. This is really good. You gonna try and get the naval HQ? Or is that not something you're interested in? Um, nope. And there's the comp. No, I'm, I'm fine with killing most of the power grid and two T2 mass extractors. Like, that, that's a win for me. I, it's I'm a good totally, investment. I'm totally yeah. down with that. I mean... Yeah, if I, if, if I was giving investment courses, then I would use you as a prime example of how to do it right, you know? So, if that's not an endorsement, I don't know what is, as far as I'm concerned. All right. So, we're good on that. Let's go ahead and grab our mass around the map as it's scattered about. And I think we should be good. Mm -hmm. Let's see, no repeat. We're gonna go ahead and throw down a naval factory and get on some boats here. Cause I got pretty much all T2 mass extractors on my core mexes. Ooh. Wow, so, that, was a, that was a quick naval factory. Wow. Yep, lots of NGs. See, in fact, you know what? I would go so far as to say my death was actually tactical, right? Because <laughs> that means Right? That means that you can get access to my mass extractors without yes. having to ask me, which would be yes, impolite. It does. You know? So, rather than being rude and say, hey, order potato, you can't actually play, you know, Forged Alliance, which, you know, you're well within your rights to say, because I can't. Whoa, that was, that was really weird there. Um, yeah, one of those epic voice breaks like I have all the time. Epi epic voice breaks. <laughs> yeah, no, um... Hey, was, let's do puberty tactical. all over again because that was yeah. fun, wasn't it, guys? Yeah. Woo. Yeah. Yeah. Woo. Yeah. Okay. I, I, I was telling I was telling my story, but it was rudely interrupted by by that that inappropriate voice break. Um. Yeah. No. I mean, you could be like, oh yeah, you're crap at the game, and you know, you'd be right. But at the same time, now that I'm dead, you can just you know, win the game all on your lonesome. Which I think is totally possible. Well, I, I can try anyway. Hey, 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 no, no, no. We don't want trying. We want, we want success. We want success, only success. We, we don't, we don't want none of this trying nonsense. Like, you know, when people say try your best. No, don't, don't try your best. Just, just do it. You do know, just your go best. out there and just, just go out there and just win. Just win. Okay. So where is the purple dude? Where is? Kirov 86. Hold on one second. I am busy queuing many, many things in my base. Okay. I'm impressed. This is very, this is very impressive. All right. So purple is something. probably that one by process of elimination. Yeah, I think you must be because that's. It looks like uh, light blue is above shouting prowler or whatever his name is. Oh, I can see that there is uh, husks of naval. Oh yeah, there's some ex some explosions going on. This looks serious, but you know what? This is actually really really good because oh, okay. watch out! Green Green's got a little naval presence down there. Yeah, I see it. I, I've got a destroyer, and I am falling short of that location. Yeah, but you see, I think this is actually very very good for you because if purple is getting destroyed, then that means green is going to have to dedicate more resources to actually holding back an offense on that front, right? Yes. So you can just, uh, like, you know, push in, break his concentration or whatever, and uh, do a little bit of a smashy-smashy sort of thing. 
Yep, Maybe yep. Be great. Let's see. Uh, let's see what he's got over there. Because if he doesn't have too terribly much, once I get a second destroyer out, I may actually be able to go ahead and just frigate KO that. Yeah, just frigates. Cybern frigates. Never underestimate the Cybern frigate. Just, just frigates. They're a freaking and, strong boat. And and a torpedo launcher. So it's okay. Mm -hmm. I'll just make some hover tanks. Oh, hover tanks and a cruiser. They're such a good combo, aren't they? Like. Destroyer and cruiser. They, they pair really well together. Well, they're the opposite of each other. Well, with well. Aeon especially, because uh, the Aeon destroyer has zero anti-air. None. And the Aeon cruiser has the most boss AA for the mass, pretty much of anything. Yeah. And um, so you have to have both of them, because otherwise your destroyers are totally defenseless. Yeah. Uh, watch out, you've got some boats coming in from the north. Yeah, I think those are or hover tanks, actually. Yeah, they're not boats. Jeez Louise. Oh man. Build a radar so we can see what's coming at us. I think that would be wise. I'm gonna be like your your slightly crappy second brain. You know, like... I, I don't know. Like, imagine if you were like an intoxicated version of yourself who just like had no <laughs> motor function or ability to know anything. Oh, then that that's would great. be me. That's great. Oh. Purple's got the middle island. Ah. How is Purple in trouble? I, I don't think he is. He lost a couple of mass extractors, so he may have had cruisers to deal with or something. I don't know. Yeah. But uh, one way or the other, he is uh, not really not really in a bad place at the moment. Um, no. Probably he doesn't have the whole Middle Island, I would think. The next time I get a scout, I'll ping it over that. Because he has to share with Green, obviously. It looks, it looks like he does. I mean, there's... There seems to be no new, no new pieces of mass or burnt out mass lying around, as far as I can see. Yeah. I All right, that. I'm gonna be extremely dastardly here. Dastardly? Wow, it's been a long time since I've heard that word. That's really? Crazy. Yeah, dastardly. My dastardly plan. I'm gonna build a buttload of T1 bombers because that sounds like a fun thing to do. Ah, you've you've started using the word buttload, have you? I like that. I, I've always used the term buttload. You see, I like I like to think that I'm I'm partly in, uh, responsible for making that that mainstream. Just just putting it out there. Just putting it out there. <laughs> <laughs> no, Can't I'm be entirely. <laughs> no. You see, my gag my gag always is like when I'm like, oh yeah, it's a buttload, and that is a scientific measurement, even though it's not a scientific measurement. Um, I just like saying it anyway. Oh 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 oh! Looks like light blue is going to be going for a little. Uh, Assault on purple. I would I would wager a bet that that North Ireland is completely controlled by blue. Well, I just uh, successfully. Well, no, he must have dropped the bomb. I was about to say I just successfully took out a radar and three engineers with one bomber pass. Wow, so that works. That's a thing. See, some somebody once told me that if you um, if you get a bomber to drop its bombs on two engineers, it makes its mass back. Potato. Like, unbelievably. Potato. Like, <laughs> I am going to fry you. <laughs> you know what? I, I'm gonna I'm just gonna continue doing that. I have no shame. <laughs> no shame at all. Alright, I've got three destroyers now. I think I am totally within my rights to go ahead and just swarm this place. I've got about thirty T1 hover tanks at the moment. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And uh, I don't think there's anything that this guy can do to stop me because I've also got a bunch of T1 bombers. He does have some uh, T1 subs in there, but they're going to be no match for destroyers. Oh. So, yeah. no worries, no worries at all. Okay, so how would how would you rate your chances? Give me it out of a hundred percent. What is what is your chances uh, of victory? You know, it's important to note that you are the highest ranked player. Um, but you're you're a very intelligent teammate. Oh, down, aren't you? oh, purple is down. This is good for you. This is good for your assault. Oh, ACU is on the land. Holy cow! We're gonna try That's to get a kill here. Yeah, awesome. Totally. I support you. Uh, you know what? You know, I I, I really think uh, sometimes you know people underestimate the value of moral support and uh, you know good moral support especially and uh, I think in he's, he's in, not dodging he's not dodging no he's dead he's dead there he goes 
Oh, get my air I out. Think, uh, ah, crap. What? 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 I lost uh, quite a few swift winds in that ACU explosion. Oh, that's that's pesky. But you know, as I was saying about you know, you know, moral enthusiasm and morale, I think you know, you can't uh, underestimate you know the whole responsibility of a morale officer, which is uh, a title that I like to pride myself with, unjustly probably. All right, we need oh, well. to finish this P-Gen because we are power stalling like a mofo here. What is your what is your plan? Are you planning to do something? Also, there's like a big collection of units that are coming directly south towards you. Yeah, I've that. already got all of my T1 tanks moving that way, and I am queuing my navy right now. Um, you're talking about units over here? No, I'm talking about units over here. Oh. Yeah. Well, I've got four destroyers on that side, so hopefully yeah, we will be, be alright. Should be fine. Oh, you're getting shelled on the very, very left hand side. Yeah, I'm not nothing I can do about that at the moment. Alright, so those are destroyers. Shouldn't have any problem killing those off. Yeah, it's just one yeah, destroyer yeah. and a couple of frigates. Alright, so we're gonna be good. We're gonna be good. Fine and dandy and good and swell and amazing. And crap, I need to build point defense. Point defense! El Pronto. Ooh, is he gonna make it? I don't think you're gonna make it, man. I, I, I'm hopeful, but ooh, it's gonna be close. No, you're not gonna do it. You're not gonna do it. You're not gonna be able to do it. Depends if he micros it. Oh, oh, he's gonna get be it so in, close. Get it in, get it in, get it so in, get close. it in. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, no. Four health away. Oh my goodness. What a shame. That that could cost you the game, man. That could be quite literally cost you the game. I don't think that will single-handedly do it, but... No, I uh, don't think it will either. No, not at all. I don't even think you're going to lose much from that assault over there. And and now, you know, let's think positively. You've got access to the entirety of the South Island, so to speak. So that's kind of nice. Yes, it is. And I'm not going to get pushed off because I do have plenty of point defense um, down south. So I think we're going to be fine here. And there's a whole bunch of mass in the water. There's a whole bunch of mass on the island, I think. Yeah, yep. there's, he's, he's got his factory. He's got all of his infrastructure that is still waiting to be reclaimed. Oh, and there's still a, a good juicy amount of uh, mass in the middle, probably around about 4,000. Oh, no, more than 4,000. Holy cow. Oh, good lord, that's a lot of T2 subs. Man, Why is he you know building what? T2 subs when destroyers win versus subs? You gotta believe, man. You gotta believe. Hey, I, I do not understand this tactical decision because it makes no sense whatsoever. <clears throat> you know what? That's fine. We're just gonna kill all of his subs, and then we're gonna reclaim all of his mass. Oh, yes. I, I like this, this whole strategy. I like this strategy a lot. We're gonna ah. go kill all of his build power. Wow, this... That was that was wreckage. Watch out, you're gonna be pincered. Yeah, I see it. Yeah. I am pulling back now. That's just gonna be Seraphim, so my destroyers are gonna be stronger than his in that situation as well. And it looks like he does have a cruiser coming to the fight, so yep, one destroyer versus five, <clears throat> six, and a cruiser. So I am in a pretty little position here. I'm gonna go ahead and go back around the back and I'm gonna kill off the naval production on that side. Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. yeah the HQ. So we should be fine. And then I am going to go to the center with my Auroras and attempt to kill off that section. Let's go ahead and queue up uh, some bombers just to soften yeah. up those targets. Something you also probably need to bear in mind that they're capitalizing on is that this entire island is completely yes. empty. And that will have... that will How much mass is that got on it? Oh my god. That's got, that's got tens of thousands of mass on it. Yeah, that's a lot of mass. That's okay because I have a I have an ACU in the water right here that I am about to murder. An ACU in the water. Oh wow, you're gonna kill it right now. Right now. How much you want to bet? Quite a lot, actually. Quite a lot. You know what? I like the enthusiasm. He's, is he trying to finish the torpedo launcher? No, he's not. Oh wow. 
Well, however much of imaginary cash we bet, it looks like you're going to be correct. It's not like going onto land is going to save him either. I mean, the destroyer. No, because he's got a lot of land, destroyers but... on him. Is he... <laughs> Boom, wow. Oh, he's dodging. He's dodging. He's a feisty one. But boom, He's not going to make it, though. He absolutely is not going to make it. Oh, I just hope goodness. that the other one is kind enough to stay in the water in the back. I was advised <laughs> to build subs. Uh. <laughs> oh, man, that was good. All right, I gotta kill this T3 factory here before he gets any more T3 subs out. Cause those oh. suckers are annoying as all crap. Oh. He, just, he just got one. He just got one. That's okay, I got another three destroyers coming up from the back. One on one, Aeon destroyers are actually stronger than T3 subs. The problem is that the range is not as good. Yeah. So that is a problem. But um, anyway, whatever the case may be, I am going to flood his entire island with auroras because that sounds like a fun thing to do it sounds like an amazing thing to do although i imagine i imagine that the acu is probably backed off to some sanctuary up here but probably that's... but we're just gonna go ahead and train wreck everything train wreck it train wreck and everything is actually uh one of my favorite pastimes actually one of my favorite pastimes i'll have you know my goodness you are you are certainly uh train wrecking that's for sure all right i just had a mechs disappear why did my mechs disappear when mechs does disappear usually that means there are bad things coming for you hmm oh my goodness you just completely surrounded them that's him this is amazing this is amazing you know what i'm gonna i'm gonna claim some sort of responsibility for our success because i was <laughs> on the team you were on the team. I, if only I for a like brief period, you were on the team. <laughs> I would like to think that I'm still there in spirit. You know what I mean? I'm still there in spirit. <laughs> oh, good okay. lord. There's a T1 point defense wrecking my crap. Oh, yeah. Kill it. Kill it with fire. There we go. All right, there we're we good. Go. There, and there's a tech 2 point defense further on there, but that's going to do less damage because I think that's a... Uh, a beam that takes time to recharge, I think? Yes. Yeah, sweet. Ooh, okay, so, okay, bet somewhere the ACU actually is. Where do you think he in is? In the water, somewhere. Okay. Not sure where. Probably off in a corner. I think, yeah, yeah, sort of delay the inevitable. He is going to try oh. to make a stand over on this side. I need to go kill his factories on the north. All right, so let's back up here. No, 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 no. Crap. What? What's going on? The T2P gens blew up and took out like half my tanks with them because oh. Oh, okay. because explosive buildings. Oh, I there is a say. there is a cruiser down there. That's why all of my stuff is dying. I mean, you say. You say you lost. Uh, oh my goodness! This is a sonar platform. This can move. Yeah. What the hell is the this? The T3 can. The T3 can. I did not know this. Is that cross-factional? So can all factions do that? Yes, except Seraphim does not have a T3 sonar. It's only T2. But in exchange for that, they get like way longer range at about the same energy cost um, uh -huh. as, as a balancing point. Okay, so we need a hell of a lot of hover tanks on this southern corridor because I think we're about to get massively invaded by T1 artillery spam. So we need to do something about this. Um, you you want to hear my advice? What is your advice? Uh, my advice is Actually, to win. looks like these are engineers. They are oh. engineers. Oh my god. This is a totally harmless pile of engineers. Wow. All right, now we just need to scout everything and torpedo the commander wherever he may be. You know what? That see, this is this is that was a that was actually probably a good tactical move. Like if he had anything else left to give, I I, I don't really know about subcom, but 
you know, to you, that looked like tier one artillery, and you responded to that, right? Oh, that oh, is a, uh, yes. That is a tactical missile commander chilling out right there. So we're going to kill him. <laughs> there we go. Tactic a tactical missile commander. Yes, the tack pack. You can see that yellow dot right there coming in, killing my factory. That's what was killing off all my mass extractors. Ah, okay. That's quite, yep, that was yep. quite a novel idea, actually. It, it's a very good idea, and it's actually why on the uh, on my home base, I have a shield over my power generators and a TAC missile defense to prevent mm -hmm. any cheesy wins, people TAC sniping me <laughs> or trying to kill off my eco or something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I get, I get you. I get you. That was a really good game, wasn't it? That was really good was fun. very fun. Coolio. I mean, yeah, I, I feel that, you know, as moral support, I, I did like a 9 out of 10 job. I'm not going to lie. I feel like it, uh... <laughs> and you gave me all the mass extractors I want, I needed to powerhouse that economy. <laughs> Exa exactly. All on purpose as well. I mean, geez. Absolutely. All righty, guys. I think that's going to wrap it up for this game. Hopefully you enjoyed it as much as I, well, as much as I enjoyed playing it. Way to stumble over your words right there at the brink. 10 out of 10 on the wrap-up. All righty. Thanks, Potato, yeah. for joining us. <laughs> Anytime, man. Love it. Love it. Uh, we will see you in the next one. Adios. Bye.